everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I thought that I would film an unboxing video. Now, I'm still quite shocked by how well my handbag collection video has gone down. I really thought that that was going to be quite controversial and there was going to be people that were quite negative about it and actually everyone has been so positive. So it's really exciting and it means that I can like share a bit more of the things that I enjoy and um, the products and brands that I enjoy. So yeah, I thought I would kick things off by introducing maybe unboxings. It'll teach me to be a little bit more patient because I am that person that always orders things next day delivery because I can't wait for them to arrive. So this box arrived last night and it has killed me. If you're following me on Snapchat, you will know that I have just been looking at this box wanting to open it. Um, but I haven't because I really wanted to like share it with you guys and show you my first in impressions. I'm just going to get into the box and get it open because I actually really want to wear what I bought today. So let's go. Okay, here is the box. Um, it's still got its cellophane on it so you know that I haven't opened it. Um, I love the packaging that Louise Via Roma comes in. It's very sleek and um, it's obviously got the branding on it as well, but it's just understated. It's not too like flamboyant, there's no bows or anything like that, but it's just very, very smart. Um, I'm going to use to open it, this is quite funny, I, um, I got sent this in a parcel, I think it was from Wonderbra. They sent this, it's actually like an eyebrow, like you can kind of like shape your eyebrows with it. Just get rid of like excess hairs, like the little baby ones that you can't really pluck out. Um, and I did use it and it's amazing, so I need to get another one because actually it's kind of become my tool for opening packages and boxes in my office because it is really, really good. And it's not too long either, so you're not gonna like cut into anything. Um, sorry to the people from Wonderbra about that. It's really good, it works, and I did use it, but now I've kind of blunted it by using on this, so I need to get another one. Let's get into it. <laughs> start here. It's so difficult like when you've got packages you just literally want to open them straight away and I just didn't do it. I was really, this is prob probably the most patient I've ever been in my life with something like this. It's so hard. Um, I've been sat in my office all morning because then when I was um, waiting to film I put my laptop in because I have to film on my, uh, I'm not sure if you know this, but I have a Canon 5D and it doesn't have autofocus so I always have to check whether I'm in focus. So that's why if you ever see me looking down it's just like a double check that you're not looking at a smudge or a blur. Um, so yeah, I put my, my laptop on charge and then Ali unplugged it. Why do men do that? Why do they unplug things that you know that you plugged in for a reason? It's so annoying. Um, so this was supposed to be filmed a lot earlier and I still hadn't opened it, so it's been killing me, but let's go. The box says Louisa the Aroma on it, which is really nice and smart. Then that's how it's come boxed. It's got a little bit of a bow on it. Um, it's kind of, I think it's navy. And then you've got the packing receipt and some tissue paper. <gasps> okay, I'm just gonna show you this now because, oh my God. That's how it's come packaged. Just checking that you can see that. <gasps> okay, which one should we open first? Um, hmm. Let's just go for the dust bag, seeing as that's already opened. Okay, so this is the bag. And inside, oh my god, this is so cute. <gasps> How cute is that? <laughs> this is the Saint Laurent Sac du Jour. I hope I've said that right. Um, and this is the mini one, I think. I didn't expect it to be this small, actually. I thought it would be a little bit bigger than this, but oh my god, it's so cute. I definitely wouldn't fit my camera in this. Oh my god, I can't believe how small it is, it's so sweet! I am obsessed with small handbags at the moment and this is super cute. Um, it's got the lock and... Yeah, it's got the little padlock on the front there that comes in its own little leather pouch. Um, and then it's got its crossbody strap, like that. And then inside you've got the authenticity cards. Ah, so the keys. Oh, well, cute, so they've got a little like key thing with a popper on it and you can pop it inside the bag if you can see that in there. <laughs> and then there's an inside pocket which has the Saint Laurent thing. Oh, that's so sweet. I can't believe how small it is. That's literally the cutest thing ever. 
my phone doesn't fit. <laughs> This would kind of be like a going out bag for me because my phone's always either in my hand or in my pocket anyway. Um, so I'd just be keeping like lipsticks and a little bit of makeup and maybe like my money and my card wallet in there. Um, and it'd just be worn like crossbody and you wouldn't even like, you wouldn't have to worry about it for the whole night. Um, but it's very, very sweet. And I just can't believe how cute and dinky it is. That's just lovely. Be good for flying as well, because I always carry like a hold all bag with all of like my bits in, but then I like to have a crossbody bag with like the essentials in. And so this would be good to keep those, th th those bits and bobs in. Um, it's got gold hardware um, and a little gold Saint Laurent Paris on the front. And yeah, I think that's so cute. I might wear that to um, London Fashion Week as well. That's, that's so sweet. Aww, <laughs> so cute. So I'll pop that back in the dust bag to look after it. And in this box, now this is something that I've wanted for a while. I really wanted like a nice makeup bag to keep all my makeup in when I wear like bigger bags. And um, I saw this one on Louise Vieroma and it looked very, very smart. So I popped that on my order as well and um, Hopefully, <laughs> it's going to fit all of my makeup in it as well, because I've not actually seen these before. Okay, there's another dust bag. And then the authenticity card again for this one. Okay, it's got another one of these uh, tags on, which means that you need to, um, if, you got, like, if you want to be able to return it, I think that you have to have these tags intact. So it means that people can't like wear things and then say, oh, I don't want it anymore. Um, so let's get that off. And there it is, and it's the perfect size. It's exactly what I wanted. Again, it's got the gold hardware, but it's got the YSL um, on the zip, and then Saint Laurent Paris on the front, and then inside, got some more packaging. Inside, it's like grained leather, or that might be canvas actually, which is really good because I always tend to get like bits and bobs and like makeup on the bottom, so this will like wipe clean really easily. It's also got a little internal pocket, which I've actually not ever seen on makeup bags, which is cute. But I also think that maybe this could like double as a little like clutch bag because it's quite a cute size, and again, it's like enough to fit your phone in and um, some makeup and some lipstick and just maybe some money. So actually really sweet. Oh, I'm really happy with that. Ah. <laughs> As always with these videos, I've popped all of the links to the products down below. Um, so you, if you want to have a look at them or pick anything else up, then I've popped them down there. But yeah, I am so happy with both of these. They are so beautiful and so cute as well. They're going to get used a lot and they're going to be really versatile as well. This can go in like all of my handbags and this is going to be used a lot on like traveling and nights out and things like that. So that is it from my first unboxing video. I really hope that you've enjoyed it. It's probably going to be quite short and sweet, but it's nice to see the first impressions and also like my reactions when I open them. Um, I'm going to be styling these up as usual over on my blog. So if you want to have a look at how I've styled them or get any ideas for styling bits yourself, then I always suggest checking out my blog because there's always outfit posts going up and um, new products and new bits and bobs that I've been buying. So it's a really good idea to go over there and you can check it out at LydiaEliseMillen.com But I think that's everything. I really hope that you've enjoyed this video and if you did, let me know with a little thumbs up. And you can subscribe below and follow me also on Snapchat, Instagram and Twitter as usual. But other than that, I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!